was the hadith. So now he's mentioned the chain and he's mentioning the hadith. What's the hadith? This is very important, guys. The Prophet ﷺ said, whoever says upon me that which I did not say, then let him take his seat in the fire. Barang siapa sengaja berdusta terhadapku, atas namaku, maka hendaklah ia persiapkan tempat duduknya di neraka. Barang siapa berkata tentangku yang tidak pernah aku katakan, maka hendaklah ia persiapkan tempat duduknya di neraka. So before he quoted this hadith, which is very popular, he quoted the whole chain. We learn a couple of things from this. Number one, the Prophet ﷺ has narrated that anyone that says something that the Prophet didn't say, intentionally let him take his place in the fire. Wait, 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 Mr. Ali Dawa. According to your most trusted sources that you just mentioned, if anyone lies against the Prophet of Islam, let him take his seat in hellfire. But according to the most famous and trustful imams and scholars in Islam, like Imam Bukhari, Imam Muslim, Ahmed ibn Hanbal, and, and Nisa'i, they said, Hafs is not to be trusted, he is a liar, and all of his hadith is matrug, i.e. rejected. What did your golden chain, what did your most famous of famous hadith say about someone who lies against the Prophet? Mr. Ali Dawa, what did you say again? Prophet has narrated that Anyone that says something that the Prophet didn't say, intentionally let him take his place in the fire because you're lying against the Messenger of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. But wait, are you telling me that all of you Muslims who are using the recitation of Hafs for the Quran, all of you are reading a recitation of a guy who according to your golden chain and most authentic hadith, he is in hellfire because he lied against the Prophet. Why did he lie against the Prophet of Islam? Because all of his hadith is rejected and he is called a liar. Muslims, you need to wake up. The Quran that you now have in your masjids and mosques and in your houses is from a man, i.e. Hafs, who is now, according to your most trusted hadith he is in hellfire wake up muslims this is how to deal with the quran of hafs we just destroyed the hafs quran in couple of seconds has narrated that anyone that says something that the Prophet didn't say intentionally let him take his place in the fire because you're lying against the messenger of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala okay hmm. so what, what do you do is right so as you as we as we Muslims right we have Quran and Hadith right mm-hmm so Quran is Quran is the only div divine revelation from God. Your Quran you have today, you don't have the book of Sahaba. This is a big fat lie. You Muslims have zero book. It's called book of Sahaba. You have recitation well, of a guy you, were, you claim. You never Hold read on. It then. You claim. You read Hayat Sahaba? Yes, I did read it. There's no book. It's called the book of Sahaba. This is a big fat lie. Where where we can it's find? Okay, where we can find? Where we can find the oldest Quran, please? Can you show me? The oldest Quran. Mm. That's what you have in in our in in front of you. In the no, this is the, the this Quran. is the recitation of Hafs. <laughs> recitation of Hafs. Yes. Do you want to show your proof? Okay. Do you so have the do, you have the, maybe, do you have you heard do, it, you do you have the do you have the Quran in Arabic in front of you? Okay. Do you have the Quran in Arabic in front of you? Yes, I do. Okay, go to page A. Page A of the Quran. Page A. 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 
Eight or A? A, A as Apple. There is no A page. Um, I don't know what kind of Quran you have, but anyway, here we go. This is the page A. Look with me on the screen. Look with you on the screen, okay. Yes. Riwayat to Hazan Mus'haf, and you speak Arabic, so you have no excuse, correct? I'm so proud about you, Prophet. I'm so proud about you. Mute, uh, mute you too, please. So now, what do you want? You sent me a link of uh, Christian... Mute, mute you too. All right. Let me see. I'm, I'm getting on. Okay, this is Rabaya Hadal Mushaf. Did you mute YouTube? Yeah, I did. Yeah. Okay. Do you see it says Kutiba Hadal Mushaf, Rabaya to Hadal Mushaf, or Mustalahat or Rasmihi? Kutiba Hadal Mushaf ul Kareem. This is not Quran. This is a Mushaf. This is number one. It is just pages. According to, let's, let's see what according to means. Read with me carefully, please. According okay. to Wadibata Alama Yuwafiq Ruwaya to Hafs, do you see it? Yes, I see it. Yeah, okay. okay. Bin Sulaiman Ibn al Magira Al Asadi al Kufi al Kira at Yaasim. Okay. Okay. So why you are saying to me that you have the book of the Sahaba? You have recitation of Asim, recitation of Hafs, and Hafs was exist more than 250 years after Muhammad. So you are saying that the Quran was not preserved. That's I am not to... saying it is says that in front of you. This is according to recitation, not a book. You don't have a book of how even Hafs, which came more than 200 years after Muhammad. You don't have his book. And guess what? Do you know who's Hafs? Okay, say, 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 do you, whatever do you know, do first. you know who's Hafs? Hafs accused by Muslim to be a thief and a fraud. Do you know that? Go, go, go ahead. You can go right now, type in Google. Hafs was a fraud, Hafs was a thief, Hafs was a liar. The, the hadith of Hafs is rejected. Why? Because he's a liar. So, how a guy who is accused to be a thief by Muslims, not by me, a guy who create hadith, al hadith, a guy who fabricate hadith, how a guy like this you can carry the Quran from him, and not only that, guess what? He is he himself, he learned the Quran from who? From Asim, do you know who's Asim? Uh, go ahead. I guess you have no idea. Asim is his stepfather. The stepfather of Haf Hafs is the same as Hafs. Both of them, they are a scam. And accused okay. by Muslims, all the scholars that they are scammers. So you don't have a Quran. You have a Hafs, a, a scammer <laughs> book. Actually, even, even him himself, he don't have his book. You say that this is according to, according to, according recitation of Hafs, the same Al-Bukhari. There's no book Al-Bukhari. Until okay. now, Muslims don't have a book of Al-Bukhari. Do you know that? We don't have the book of Al-Bukhari? No, you don't. The book of Al-Bukhari, you have books claiming that this is a copy of the copy of the copy of the Bukhari, but nobody have Al-Bukhari, and nobody have Sahih Muslim. Nobody. Okay. So, you Quran is based in a thief, based on a fraud, he and his father, who came more than 200 years after Muhammad. So, how you how you say to me, the Quran was carried by blah, blah, blah. He said, he said, preserve. The what Quran preserve? Was, the Quran was written by Osman, okay? My friend, where is the Uthman? Quran, Here we go. Look how many names. Look how many. Look, my friend, there's, do you have, okay, you, you just said written by Uthman. Do you have the book of Uthman? This is the book of the Uthman. Quran. No, he this wrote, is, this is this, it says in the front of you, you read Arabic. You claim you read Arabic, right? Riwaya too. Do you see it? Yes, here we were. Okay, so if you have rewired to have student, if you have Uthman, listen. This is not the only page that you will judge the whole Quran. This is the whole Quran. This is the beginning of the Quran. They are telling you this is according to who? So from the beginning, it says this is according to the rewire, not according to Uthman. If you have the book of Uthman, you do not need Hafs. Listen, listen. If you have the book of Uthman, who needs Hafs? Nobody. Correct? Okay, go. Do you understand me? Yeah, understand. Okay, you if you have the original, uh, let us say you have my book, Christian Prince, then you do not need to say that somebody, this is according to, according to, according to, according to Christian Prince. We, we have the book of Christian Prince, who need the according to? Nobody. But because you don't have any of those books, then you have to go by according to. And this is why we see here, according to Hafs ibn Sulaiman ibn Mughira, according to Asim, according ibn Abdul Rahman ibn Abdullah, according to etc., according to, according to, according to, according to the Prophet. So all this according, starting from who? From Hafs, and Hafs is a fraud. 
Hafsa is not a fraud. You, 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 okay. The thing is, you, okay. In the front. Uh, okay. You, okay. Okay. Hold on. In no, the front. No, no, no. The in is, the front listen, of everybody. You are, you okay, are my friend. Listen. Listen. If I show you, if I show you your Muslim website saying that Hafsa is a fraud, what you would do? Don't you? I listen. I don't follow Muslim websites online. No. 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 Muslim so, scholars. Muslim we, scholars. Muslim scholars. Muslim websites or Muslim scholars. Okay. Mm. Which scholars are you talking about right now? Scholars, all all kind of names. What do you want? <laughs> who care? I mean, what kind of scholars? Who care? Okay, bring bring uh, Mufti Muhammad Shafi. Who is this guy, Mufti Shafi? We are talking about scholars. What Shafi? Say hi to and Shafi. How Shafi? How Shafi is doing? Shafi. Read, read with me. Read with me. Read with me. All oh, those are real scholars, not Shafi. Shafi, not Shafi. Shafi. قال عبد الرحمن بن ابي حاتم عن عبد الله عن 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 متروك الحديث وقال عمر عن محمد بن شعيب الصابوني عن حنبل بن اسحاق عن احمد بن حنبل احمد بن حنبل قال عثمان اتس عن عن حنبل بن اسحاق عن احمد بن حنبل they are quoting for you all those kind of names and they are saying what that his hadith is متروك read carefully with me and then he says قال ابو قدام ابو قدامه وعثمان بن سعيد الدرامي أن يحيى بن بن معين ليس بثقة is not trustworthy أن وقال علي علي ابن المديني ضعيف الحديث وتركته على عمد he is a person who you know we cannot trust him then he continue وقد فرغ منه الدهر he is a liar وقال البخاري البخاري تركوه all حديث is متروك that's it we throw it وقال مسلم متروك apa itu hadis متروك Hadis matruk adalah hadis yang para rawinya, secara individu melakukan kebohongan, agar hadis itu bertentangan dengan kaidah-kaidah yang telah diketahui, dan tidaklah diriwayatkan kecuali berasal dari dirinya rawi itu sendiri. Pengertian lainnya, hadis matruk adalah hadis yang dalam sanatnya, ada seorang perawi yang diduga kuat sebagai seorang pembohong. Haf, disebut oleh beberapa ulama sebagai seorang pembohong, dan tidak dapat dipercaya, dan hadisnya matruk. Sahih Muslim, wa qala nisa'i, laysa bi thiqa. An nisa'i, he said, is not trustworthy. And then he says, wa qala fi mawda'a akhir, matruk. وقال صالح بن محمد البغدادي لا يكتب حديثه وأحيثه كلها مناكير all of it is a lie all of it and then let us continue let us let us quote more hold on hold on we are, we are not done uh, uh, okay here we go وقال أبو أحمد بن عدي عن الساجي عن أحمد بن محمد البغدادي عن عن يحيى بن معين كان حفص بن سليمان وأبو بكر بن عياش من أعلم الناس بقراءة عاصم وكان اتسطر وكان كذابا do you see it? Yeah, I see it, yeah. Okay, okay. so right. you must have saying he's a liar, he's a fraud. And let me show you more. This is not only, we are not done. I just search in Google, just like a random search, and we, we got, there's tons of, of, uh, 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 of reference speaking about how stupid this man is. Read with me. Hold, look, look at this uh, reference. This yeah, is from Al-Bukhari at tarikh Al-Kabir, variant number two. Uh, uh, Al-Bukhari At-Tariqh Al-Saghir, variant number two, page number 233. Sakatu anhu, wa munkaru al-hadith. Read with me carefully. This yeah, is Al-Bukhari Al-Du'afa Al-Saghir, raqamu al-Safha 35. This is your Muslim website, not my website. I'm just reading what, what they have there. Hafs ibn Sulaiman ibn al-Asadi Abu Umar, an alqama an 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 wa qala Ahmad ibn Hanbal. Ahmad ibn Hanbal, you know who's that, right? This is not a joke. Yeah. Okay. He said, qala Yahya akhbarani shu'ba qal, أخذ مني حفص بن سليمان كتابا فلم يرده قال وكان يأخذ الكتب الناس فينسخها he is a thief he copied the the books of people and he 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 write it and he says this is my book listen 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 الألباني 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 ضعيف سنن الترمذي he says read carefully and you know ضعيف جدا all what he what he says he is a you know he says where you ضعيف الحديث الألباني all of those reference in front of you so سمعت أبي يقول حفص بن سليمان يعني أبو عمر القارئ متروك الحديث his hadith is thrown in the garbage why because he's a liar really continue all of this is your Islamic website Islamic your reference so you are taking the Quran from a thief literally accused to be a thief 
So we're how? We're not taking it from him. We we took it from Osman al Banano. My friend, okay. we are talking about uh, no. We are talking about the Quran you have today. You have it from Hafs. So the Quran that we have today is from Osman al Banano. No, you that are you don't you, you don't have the book of Osman. Okay. You have what is what what Hafs recite to you. <laughs> not Hafs recited to us. It's it's most of them recited to the Sahaba and the Sahaba. You have the book now. You have no. This is according. I showed you the image. This is according to the recitation of Hafs, and not only that not it's only Hafs is a thief even Hassan you know Hajjaj, Hajjaj bin Yusuf right uh, come on you come know. on just go go